Hi there, I'm Griffin from Fire and Ice Game Studios. Now, today I'm going to be doing a painting video on this beast of a ship, the ORS Class Heavy Cruiser. It takes a lot of paint to paint one of these guys, as I already have one of my capital ships painted, as you can see. He's this white guy right there with the gold. Now, I'm just going to paint this in the traditional Covenant colors, the purple and whatnot, and... We're going to be using several paints, all from the Citadel line of paints today. These are really nice paints. They're water-based paints, so they come off pretty easily before they dry, if you want them to, but they stay on and they look very nice. So we're going to be using Xerxes Purple, as you can see here. We're going to be using Altdorf Guard Blue, and we're going to be using Telecus blue. And I believe there's one more blue we can use. I don't have it here. Telecus looks really good in my opinion. But if you want a stark contrast, there is, I believe it's some other kind of guard blue. Can't exactly remember what it is, excuse me. I don't have the paint with me as of now. But I will hopefully show it to you guys in just a bit. Now, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to take, again, Xerxes purple and paint the whole ship. So I'll be right back after I've done that. Hi there and welcome back. Um, so for the short break, so now that I've painted this whole thing purple, it we are going to do some detail work. So you're going to take the Altdorf Guard Blue. Also, just as a heads up, sort of. The, the Citadel paints are really nice paints. They go on well and they look fantastic. Um, but they are a little pricey. Now they aren't like 20 bucks a paint, but they do cost anywhere from four to six dollars so far that I've seen. So, let's get going on some detail work. So take your favorite little brush, this is my favorite little guy, dip him in some water. Uh, a little trick that you can do is you can twirl the brush when it's wet and it will create a finer point for your brush. I thought that was kind of interesting. I learned that online. So, wait for your brush to dry a little bit, shake up the Altdorf Guard Blue, and let's get cracking on some of these details.
Hi there, and welcome back once again. I have finished painting the top. It was not easy for me to paint this thing. Um, my paint kept having some challenges, like, well, I kept having some challenges, I should say. The paint was really runny, and, well, anyways. It turned out quite nice. I'll go through piece by piece. There's the front. There's a little thing under the bow there, if you can kind of see that. There's that's painted, that's painted. And the hangers. Oh, there's a little spot right there. I will get that when we're all done. Didn't notice that. Yeah, I'm really proud of the midsection. I think that that's really nice. Okay, so now we're going to flip over to the other side. So now we're done with the ORS class heavy cruiser. It's uh, it's looking good. I'm really proud of it. So we're gonna go over each piece really quick before we end. So that's the front. Um, I think it looks pretty good. Moving on to whatever that thing is, and then the midsection. I call it the midsection. I know it's basically the rear, but it's the widest and also has the most bulk. So. I think I did pretty well on that. As you can see, the hanger has a little bit of touch-up right about there. Um, I will finish that after the fact. Here's the bottom. We're going to start with the engines. Now, as you can see, I put the darker paint in towards the middle, and then the lighter paint towards the outside. Then I just added some details all around, painted the two painted that one, whatever that is, and then I painted the energy projector. Painted that little guy right there. Painted those fins right there, and then these little side guys. In all, it didn't take too long. It took a shorter amount of time than I expected to paint this, which is nice, and I'm pretty happy with it. Um, all right. This has been Griffin with Fire and Ice Game Studios. I hope to see you guys next time. Please like and subscribe if you like this video. Um, see you next time.